and welcome back to Beaverville. A lot's come along in our town over the last couple of years. We've even had to move our headquarters to a more centralized location. The new expansion has done amazingly well. We've got trees growing. Soon we'll have wood for days. The Beavers were starting to get a little ownery in all of their hard work. So, we built them somewhere where they can pray to the great wood gods. Also, a lovely place where they can just relax at the end of the day. I've been told to expect these droughts to get a little bit longer. Although, I find that hard to believe, seeing as we're currently dealing with flooding problems. Damn this water. We've got a few big plans coming up, and expansions to make. We've got to get working on our technology. Our industry is really falling behind. Hopefully we'll be ready before the great drought comes. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Bam, welcome back to Timberborn, everybody. Uh, man, old Beaverville. Beaverton? What is this place called? It's called District 2. <laughs> Beaverton. Is that what we called it? Was it Beaverville? Or Beaverburg? God, I don't know. Uh, yeah, man, it's going pretty well at the moment. Uh, we have a lot of wood. Well, I'm pretty sure that this is going to get converted. Converted over to uh, being a different thing. Crops? Maybe? Maybe even industry. We could slam a whole load of industry in there when the uh, the river keeps going. The drought's just ended, and so this whole pool has got to kind of fill up a little bit. But that'll be okay. Uh, also, we've got a bit of flooding. I still want to turn this into like a big reservoir for us. There'll be a lot of wood, though. We do not have the most. The moment that we get everything else back online, I think we'll be good. Food looks great. Water is fine. Where do we want our next sort of, like, housing expansion to be? I guess we can, like, actually slam these in the river if we wanted to. I don't particularly want to be using up our, like, prime real estate that is the river currently. This area, I guess we could just go up a couple of layers. We'll kind of, we'll need to get a whole load of staircases in here. Let's wait, we can get double platform. Double platform! Whoa. Is that what we want? The answer is maybe. I just turn this into, like, a mega block. Kind of old Judge Dredd style. Sure, okay, I can kind of think this will work. It's a pretty big build, but we've got a lot of wood. We've got a lot of stuff going on. Wow, that is a whole load. God, that really, like, that is going to be a chunky block of stuff. Oh, okay, right, bam. Man, the sort of mega housing complex is on line. Okay, this gives us a, just a ridiculous capacity. 153. I kind of, kind of don't like this 153. Do we have a spare house I can just destroy? Sure. I kind of don't think it's actually a great idea to have everyone in one centralized block. Should move, sort of move them around a bit. Uh, so they work in, work in different like districts a bit better. We can actually set up different districts. Ah, that's something we'll worry about later. Okay, we're almost doubling our population. Uh, so I've got a lot of a lot of stuff to kind of get online. Okay, this is bad, not necessarily awful. Our food has dropped beneath a thousand. Look, we've got so much in the fields. I think it's okay. I don't think we need to worry massively about that. But maybe this is where we should start growing potatoes. Oh god, there's like so many like little little projects that I want done. Uh okay, right, we super need tech. Maybe we can make a bit of like a some kind of tech shore down here. Uh, something like this. We'll get some cogs and shit. Get some uh, other things going on. Uh, also, th this is just too many. <laughs> we just don't need that many to start off with. Uh, right, where is the path going to go? The path will come in a little bit more. We'll have a whole load of uh, build builds. Okay, we've got four more lumberjacks working on this area. We're going to clean this out. Ooh, God, wood, wood bad. I guess we've got a lot of planks. <laughs> planks growing. Uh, that's okay. Maybe it's too many planks. We are going to need planks, though. Uh, that's, that's the truth. Uh, also, what else do we want? Paper? Paper. Uh, and... Uh, yeah, I do need more gears. We do use a lot of gears as time goes by. And a printing press. We have your knowledge. 
Uh, sir, excuse me. Do you have knowledge? No. What does knowledge give you? It's your work speed. Do you not have your spirituality? Do we need more, um... Oh, we might need another temple. Oh, actually, we're definitely going to need another temple. As we've got more people. I need that, like, that work bonus. Okay, great. Factories are online. It's three cog houses. Too many cog houses. I think we can afford three out of that. Yeah, 360, three, uh, three cogs. Great. And then over this side will be paper. Uh, that looks good. Get me a warehouse. Yeah, when you get built, uh, we should be pretty pretty relaxed. Um, this should give us space to put paper on the other side when... Just when we get a bit more wood coming in. Paper mill? Yes, I want. Yeah, I reckon like two of those. How much power do they need? 80. How much does one of these make? 180. Yeah, we can just get like two water... or like a water wheel. Have two, two guys coming around. Cool. Okay. Get to work. Uh, these guys, great. And this whole area is earmarked for the great dam or the great water storage. Do we even need that? I don't know, but I like the idea of it. Oh, huh, I wondered, would it make more sense to put a dam in here? Narrow the river? It'd be cool if that's how the water wheel works, like faster flowing water generated more power. I don't even know if that's how water wheels actually work. Maybe that's how you explode your water wheel. Okay, food is now, yeah, getting a little spicier. Some of these don't have all the farmers they could. Okay, great. That fills up a good portion of this with water. Although these have to be constantly refilled. Does this have to be constantly refilled? Later on, we can actually, like, blow holes in the map uh, if we get dynamite, which would be cool. Yeah, I just wonder if that's more efficient than having one of these, like, irrigation towers. Okay, right. Also, we can't build beehives yet. Oh, beehive. And... But I do want to pre-plan, like, loosely where they'd go. Uh, because these, like, will super boost my production. Uh, and for the sake of losing out on a tiny bit of crop, I think it's pretty much worth it. Uh, so that's where they'll go eventually, and you are going to get potatoes. This whole area. Uh, we've not got a lot more beavers. What were we on before, like 60? So I guess we've gone up about 30. Is it because they're not um, making sweet beaver love to each other? It's still the social life. They need more social life. They want fun. How do I get fun? A carousel. Oh, God. Okay, carousel expensive. Very expensive. I cannot afford that. Ooh, can I actually make a laborer's monument? God, it's expensive again. Oh, I'm kind of into it. Like, throw that in, like, the housing area? Like, put it right up, up here? I don't know if we're going to go that much bigger in this area. I think we'd probably try and build up some of those, those parts. Let's make it face that way. That way we can't see his stupid little face. Right, we've got our place built. Uh, allowed. None. This is literally for gears, planks, paper. I guess it'll take, like, metal blocks. Scrap metal? Sure. Books? Explosives? Yeah, I guess it's like any of any of that like produced stuff. Uh, okay, right. They've got to build the path. What other things have been queued up that I'm not remembering? Oh, we've got like a little staircase. Please do not get yourself trapped. Uh, rest in peace, Yavo. Okay, right. We've probably got about five days until we need more water. Until the drought. We're up to 110 now. So that means we're consuming spitball 220 a day. I don't know, this kind of feels a bit like cheating, but to get rid of, like, stumps, <laughs> you can just build paths over them. Otherwise, it takes, like, a beaver, like, a couple of hours to dig up a tree stump. There. Way, way more efficient. Now they only have to kill, like, uh, you know, six, six guys. Okay, right, food's actually beginning to get, become a problem. Mm, so there's water. We've got a lot of beavers. I need wood and fast. 
Oh, and these are all going to be growing soon. Okay, that should probably solve our wood kind of issue. Oh, that's where all the resources went. They put it all into the beehives. Oh, we're not going to be able to finish those for a little while. God, we have like a lot of building projects going at once, and I'm beginning to get a little concerned for this drought. Uh, let's just get a short-term bit of extra old pompo going. Okay, I don't think these are going to stick around long-term. Uh, it's more, I just really want them to fill my existing water tanks. Ooh, God. No, we don't even have, really, two days' worth of food. Uh, luckily, the wood is really online now. Uh, I think maybe uh, additional farmhouses. Okay, we'll just, this will just be a short-term stopgap while we get some other food online. Uh, you, we do want a high shaft. Pow. Pow. Look at this. Look at this technology. Uh, come on over the top. Honestly, this is, uh, isn't actually a high priority for me at all. But it's fun. Science. <laughs> well, you're just an awkward shape, aren't you? If we connect all of this up, paper mill actually uses less power. And get rid of ACOG. God, they're expensive. But run the paper mills like that, just because they fit a little bit better. Uh, Cogulons, you can come back. Need to destroy a bit of path, but <laughs> that's fine. What are you even worried about? It's not like I spent time building it or anything. Full gear workshops, that's insane. Or is it? Nah, it's fine. Great, that's just a giganto ridiculous project. Oh, the beaver statue! It's completed! Right, do you have a little bit of ore now? Yeah, maybe. Okay, well, if that makes them work a little bit harder, because they can now see, like, oh, do you remember Gary? He could carry so much stuff. He's got a bit of like a, what's his name? Paul, Paul Bunyan vibe. It's like a big old statue of a, like a big beaver. I said that he built an entire dam in one day. He could chop down an entire forest with one bite. Oh man, I'd pay for Beaver Bot 5000 to be able to just like chomp, boom, 5000 wood. That would be pretty legit. Okay, food is steadily, steadily going bad. I need, uh, I need more, more people. Uh, we need, uh, this is actually getting closer to panic mode. Like, we don't even have an entire day's worth of food left. Uh, right, these bushes, these bushes just don't do enough for me. Uh, destroy all of that stuff. This could be good real estate for a farm. Uh, my science houses might need to dip and they can go somewhere else. Where do people like science? Who wants to do some science for me? Up here? Maybe? Hold on over there. Boom. A little science alley. Great. Tons of science. Beautiful. There's some science there, science there. We've got the people. Uh, that seems good. Uh, once again, God, do we just... Just cheat? Beautiful. Oh, God. 0.4 days. We've got a bit of water in the bank. This is going to dry up real fast, though. Um, I think we might have to look into turning this into a big... kind of crop area. How are we getting up and down here? We can make a proper little staircase and build that. Uh oh. Wow, man, they have actually like really harvested. Uh I think we're gonna have a starvation time this year. Ooh, potatoes. Ooh, potatoes. How many potatoes have we got in the bank? Three. Oh. Okay. Okay. Right. Could potatoes be our saviour? Question mark? Wow, is that the title of the video? No. No, it isn't. Uh-oh. Okay, the drought has begun. We've got a bit of water. Oh man, we do not have a lot of food. 
Right, the potatoes are all coming out. I do need my grills made. Yo, where's my grills at? Oh god, everyone else looks fine. Six days! Ooh. Yeah, we've got maybe close to three, probably just under. God, wow, we're actually really close to um, our cap on pop. We've got a lot of unemployed. I probably shouldn't have built. Who would have thought? Who would have thought that this could have bankrupted us? Big oof. Okay, the river stopped flowing. God, already this looks like it's dropping. Uh, we can get like a depth marker. Do you see how deep it is? Prioritize this. I'm curious. I'm curious how the how good the depth marker is. Okay, we've got a depth marker. Okay, so what's the deal? Water height, 1.5. L. Was I supposed to put this deeper? Probably. Highest water, 1.51. Okay, right, so it's dropping. Uh, kind of slowly. 1.49. Right, it is mm, going down a little bit faster than I was, uh, <laughs> faster than I was expecting. It'll be, it'll be fine. Uh, you guys are all offline, that is okay. Ah, uh, just we've got our paper, paper house going. Right, I don't think we're ever gonna have wood problems again. You guys need, require additional farmers, I believe, is the answer here. But we're getting cooked potatoes now. We've still got a couple of potatoes in the bank, but you guys are really gonna want some extra farm houses. Uh, how does farm, how does farm work? Which way round? Nuts. Okay, we have 33 carrots in the bank. There are some more growing, but uh, okay, there's 13 carrots in the bank. We do not have enough food for everyone. This is bad. This is real bad. Somehow. I don't quite know how. Who made the decision to bring a lot of beavers in? Uh, luckily we've got, uh, we've got some spares. We've got some spare beavers. And so, hopefully, there'll be a, well, there'll be a degree of sort of dead man's shoes. Uh, everyone can have a little job reshuffle uh, during the Great Purge. Maybe that's how we'll rebrand it. Oh, new faction. Oh, we've got the Iron Teeth. Nice. Uh, people are happy. What has made them happy? Oh, is it getting a bit of nutrition? Okay, people are pretty pretty chill. We need to get up to nutrition three. Maybe this is what we do up here, turn this into a big crop field. I just need to get people up into this farm. Okay, a couple of carrots have come out. Got a few things. Oh, nice, okay, these carrots are growing. God, do we just get more farms? Short term, I've got the people. Like, heck, just come on in, be a farmer. Um, I'm gonna risk. Water is not my main concern here. What is that? Day and a half's worth of water? Alright, let some water flow. Oh wait, we should probably do it at daytime when everyone's working. Okay, let, let it flow! Right, is that enough? Oh god, we don't want a flood. Oof. That's too much flowing. Okay, is that enough to get you to build a thing? Uh, nope! God, where's my water level at? It's dropping. Actually, in the meantime, okay, we have we have a lot of logs. Uh, I this isn't gonna save us. Stop. Halt. Halt, criminal scum. Okay, seeing as we could just have wood, what I'm kind of thinking is we get this whole area levied up. Oh great, okay right, these farmers farmers came came online. Oh now they've actually harvested. Do you wanna get just extra farmhouse in there? This might be overkill, but uh yeah, still don't, still kind of working out exactly how many farmers you need per um per thing. This maybe feels like too many farmers. I guess they are working on here. Sure. And food food's gone up. Water's gone down. My special bar tells me that. Uh oh, they are gonna run dry. Uh, day or two? Oh, I think I think we might be okay. I think so. Maybe. Okay, it is morning again. Ugh. Food isn't exactly stable, but it isn't awful. Although a bunch of our pumps are. Ooh, on the cusp of running out. 
Uh, how long do the beavers last without water? Two days, maybe? Maybe it makes sense to feed a bit of this into there. Let this guy do a bit of pumping. Because soon these are definitely going to dry up and I'm going to just gonna have to empty all the water out. Man, look at my depth stick. It's almost not in water anymore. Oof. Gross. Uh-oh. Okay, right. This bit is fully dried up now. God, you guys can just drop those floodgates. Uh, that's not really even letting any out. Well, I guess we don't actually want to have too much come down. Because that will take longer for this to fill up. Like, we are definitely going to go into the drought age. The old dry age. Ugh. Uh, 1.5 days. Some beaver's going to get uh, pretty salty sad about this. There's not a lot I can do. Did not prepare well enough. Yeah. Man, need need a better, better reserve. Uh, but that's hopefully what this is going to help me do. Okay, the new Great Dam should be good. Just a gigantic reserve of water. And as you can see, that's on everyone's minds at the moment. Thirst. Okay, everyone has to just like survive a day without water. And they've already gone about half a day, a day. It's not a ton I can be doing. Ah, oh, shit, my potatoes. Ooh, potatoes will dry out in 0.8 days. I have 0.6 days until the water comes back. Man, I need this as a priority. Okay, right, we're, we're, we're getting uh, beavers dying of thirst now. Not great. We've got beavers in the bank. Uh, we've got fresh beavers to replace them. Guys, like half a day. I know you're thirsty. Like your little beaver fur is getting all dry. Seriously, oh, if you're that thirsty, man, have it like a little out of the river. It's like you want it cleaned, but delicious. Oh god, the deaths! This is not good. It's like 0.2 days, guys. Well, it's gonna take it's gonna take hot like almost a day to fill this up. Wow. Yeah, we've lost like almost 20, 20 beavers so far. Oh god, the great drought. I knew the great drought was coming. Man, this this drought was only six days long as well. That ain't good. I need we need a way more stable water water supply coming in. This was a bad call. This was a bad goof. Expanded too too fast, maybe. Please save us, big big beaver Jeff. Oh, the drought has ended! Quick! Oh god, man, someone like literally woke up. They went to get that like, mmm, a little sip of water. Okay, everyone is dying. I guess people don't die in their sleep. Which, you know, is either nice or horrible. Depending on how you look at it. Oh, okay. The water. We're pumping again. Don't stop pumping, we need the water. Oh, I need it so badly. God, people are still dying of thirst. But the water's coming in now. Oh, did my potatoes die? It's drying out, it'll die in 0.9 days. Ooh, I guess maybe that was like a little burst of water. Ah, no, so it did dry out. Oh well. Uh, okay, they're pumping. Man, like these guys like higher up, it's kind of a bit of a pain. I need to like dig them down. These were just all like emergency ones. Okay, a little bit of water in the bank. People are still dying of thirst, which is just, just terrible. Uh, you know what, we're gonna keep pumping 24 hours today. <gasps> oh yeah, okay, right. The next layer of water, you guys pump it up. Oh no! Dry it in one point, six days, ah, we'll be, we'll be back in action by then. Okay, water is flowing, beautiful. Uh, crops are back in action, everyone is pumping, love that. Crops are good, food is good, getting some water in reserve. Okay, we'll never, we'll never let this happen again. Spoilers. He'll let that happen again. Okay, we are down a lot of people. We lost like a third of our colony to that drought. Uh, I've got to like kind of find some people to do some work. Oh, we don't need all that science. God, we've got a lot of science. I know we can just pause them, but um, I didn't super want that many science buildings anyway. Uh, lumber, I do want to keep coming in. Oh, I love how good our lumber supplies are now. 
Water is great. You can keep doing your thing. Beautiful. Wow. Okay, man, that was an eventful year uh, in Timberborn. Luckily, Big Jeff is here, and we can all praise him. All hail Jeff the Beaver. You m helped us to make it through. Uh, hopefully, um, yeah, next year won't be as bad. Well, we'll see how it goes. Until next time, everybody. See ya. <laughs>